This game over screen is starting to turn into a bad habit. But anywho, welcome to part 3 of Let's Play Mega Man Unlimited. Alright. Let's see if we can actually go somewhere this time. <laughs> I, I really did not want to go for this stage next, but... Unless, let's see where, where we can go with this. Yeah, just like I thought. Whoa, how am I supposed to kill that guy? Oh. Whoa, uh... Well, that was stupid. <laughs> well done. Let's see if that stupidity can ensue. There we go. Yeah. Now, I know you need Glue Man's weapon to actually get past those without having to worry about, you know, taking damage. So... Right, let's save the stage for later. Um... Let's see here. I kinda had a good feeling about Yo- Well, no. I sort of had a good feeling about this stage. I think this was the one I was more most comfortable with. So, let's actually go back and retry this stage again and see if we can hopefully make some more progress. Maybe? Kind of? I hope. Yeah, because if something doesn't happen, then... Maybe doing a blind LP of this was not quite a good idea. <laughs> Let's just hope I'm wrong. Move out of my way, jackhammers and spiky eyeball thingies. Alrighty, doing good so far, but we have to take taking much damage just yet. That should be a sign of good hope. Maybe. Hopefully. I don't know. And that... I dodged that somehow. I didn't dodge that though. <laughs> that was stupid. That was stupid yet again. Are these things like really random or something? I swear, they're like firing at times when you think they would, and they don't. Alrighty. Gutsman esque blocks, or platforms. You meet again. Where did I get blocks from? <laughs> That good got lucky there. Oh, alrighty. Let's wait for that to fire. Okay, shoot him down, Mega Man. <sighs> Jump cut. Okay, guys, I'm back. Sorry for that. Again, a thousand times over. And I really don't want to die to this guy right here. Hopefully the checkpoints started getting a little more lenient from this point on. Maybe. I don't know. I forget. Sorry. I know I tackled this stage once before, but... Forget things I shouldn't, and I don't know why. Okay. Come on. This is 
starting to remind me of Nintendo Capri Sun LP of this when he actually did, uh, well not this, but he did, uh, I think it was Mega Man 7, and he, it took him like the first three or so parts until he actually beat the first Robot Master, and that's sort of what this is reminding me of right now. <laughs> Let's try to conserve any tanks as much as possible, though. That is a, an of utmost priority right now. Hmm. Might want to fail up on the uh, rush coil, actually. Oh! That's not a good position to be in. Oh, wow! We're at the boss already? Huh. Yeah, I probably should have just sticked with this stage first. Oh, except it's not the boss. <laughs> What was I thinking? Oh, I know this guy! I think what the thing was, was that there was actually supposed to be a Hammer Man for this game, and Mega Phil X said, fuck that, let's make him a mini boss. Kinda like the idea, actually, truth be told. Just thought I'd share a little bit of detail with that, of that with everybody. But in here. Back to business. Yeah, I knew the spikes were going to get evil. I, I just knew it. <laughs> Let's jump over here and see where this takes us. Why not? I got really lucky. Why are these things from Yo-Yo Man stage in here? That's just all kinds of weird. Something tells me though I should have brought the spike shield with me, but at last I am an idiot. And I am an idiot for going on without thinking. <laughs> Yay for interruptions yet again. Righty then. This guy give me the help I'm hoping for. No, he did not. Not surprised. You know what? I am going to play it safe and just. Ew! That was stupid yet again. <laughs> really? <laughs> it's like he knew you were going to use Rush Coil then and there and just screw yourself over doing that. Megaphil X, you're a smart, yet dickish thinker, <laughs> all at the same time. <sighs> I don't know how you do it, but somehow you do. Barely avoided that spike, by the way. <laughs> Somehow barely avoided that too. Alright. Let's see where this takes us. Alrighty. Doing good so far. Interruptions! They're great, aren't they? <laughs> Alright, but anywho. What's over here? Yeah, I knew these things would get nasty here real soon. Oh, wow. That actually looks pretty tough. I really don't need that weapons tank. At least not yet, anyway. And luckily we're at the boss, so I don't have much to complain about. Let's just hope this boss battle actually goes well this time. Well, not this time, but... We'll see. Whoa, whoa, what, what? Okay, that's not too bad. 
Yeah, that's not too bad so far, actually. Sort of kind of reminding me of Woodman, for some reason. Oh, whoa, what? Wow. That's... Yeah, that's going to be one of those guys I don't want to get cornered by, isn't it? But I got two E-Tanks. I shan't have no guilt in using them. There's not many opportunities to hit them, though. So take every chance you can to hit this asshole. I do like how he does the same move, but he does a different attack, attack for each, and it's not completely unpredictable, because you do have enough reaction time to react to both. So far, I'm liking this Robot Master so far, and I'm not saying that because he's easy so far, but rather the fact that he's rather unique. And I do like me some unique Robot Masters. But, if we get lucky, I think we're actually going to beat a Robot Master this time. Mash that fire button, Mega Man. Alright. I think we're going to actually beat this guy. Let's just hope for the best. No, not where I wanted to be. Alright, let's make way, way past that, actually. Alright. You can do it, Ken. Believe in yourself. see this game has its own victory fanfare. That's cool. But I don't care because I finally beat a robot master. Thank god. Ah. Oh, I'm so happy right now. You got nail shield and speaking of devil, we get rush jet as well. Well, I just have to say that's if I had to tell anybody who would go after first, I don't have much experience, but just go after this guy first. And I'm too proud right now, so uh, to help gain back my sanity and hopefully get enough experience in for next time. And by experience, I mean breathing space. I'm just going to save the rest of the progress I'm going to be doing next for the next video. So next time in part four. We will figure out who Snail Nailman's weakness well weakness. Whatever. Whatever his weapon is weak against too. We'll figure out somehow. But anywho, thank you guys for watching and see you all then.